Hey everyone, welcome back to Welsh Farms. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video today. This footage was actually shot back in the fall when I did some overseeding on my parents' property and mine here at my house. And then we ended up drilling wheat over at my new field in Woodlawn that's called Madden's Field. So thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoy it. custom brush hogging so I uh, got a hold of the owner of this field and it's uh, about 14 about 14 acres and brought the MX6 out here <laughs> so it, it took me a little bit of time uh, but we got it done actually the uh, the owner of the field is interested in uh, in leasing it out so I think I'm gonna uh, run some numbers, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna try and uh, plant this in wheat this year and uh, Fortunately, I ran into a farmer uh, That's in the neighboring field here. He's actually working up his ground today and I uh, asked him if he would combine this wheat and uh, well, before that work up the field for me and Then we can get this thing planted. So have no straw next year Just stay uh, stay tuned and uh, we'll keep you guys up with you. All right, just got done mowing over a portion of the field a uh, second time here at Madden's Field. Some of the crabgrass bottoms didn't really mulch up real good the first time. So uh, I got a neighboring farmer. Uh, I'm gonna pay him to come over here tomorrow and uh, work this field up a couple times, uh, turn in that vegetation, and uh, planted in wheat next weekend. So everything went really good. Stay tuned. All right, so before we actually drill some wheat, like I said, I'm gonna take that drill and do some overseeding first. I just finished up here at my parents' place. Got it all seeded. Ended up being 6.7 acres uh, on the counter on the drill here. So I'm gonna haul this thing over to my house. I haven't decided if I'm gonna seed it tonight or tomorrow morning yet, but definitely need to get it and the wheat field done by tomorrow night because rain's coming uh, it's not supposed to be a lot but still it's supposed to have a chance of rain saturday night and sunday night so that would be good uh didn't have any problems today uh, this drill was amazing it was all that the john deere wanted to handle i'll tell you we we're coming up the hill here and at a couple points i just had to lift up the the down pressure a little bit but uh it did really good did everything that i asked it to so we're gonna haul this back to my place then i gotta bring the truck back and put the tractor on the trailer so still got a long long night left but we'll get it done okay so i didn't get footage of overseeding at my place it was super early in the morning and I wanted to get over to Madden's at a decent time. So let's go out there and hop on the tractor. I just started drilling wheat.
I gotta take a break. Just got done doing all the rounds and there's like a little finger that sticks out uh, east in this field. So I got it all done and all I got left to do is a bunch of north and south. So I needed to take a break. I wanted to double check. Now that I'm definitely out of the, the shadows and into the harder ground, just make sure that the seed's at a good depth here. So let's check it. inch inch and an eighth that's perfect all right wheat seed as weston would say good night oh yeah i think we got a few acres left So here's some drone footage of what Madden's Field looks like. This was on October 28th of 2019 and you can see there wasn't much uh, overlap and not any bald spots that I can see so uh, that ended up working out well with the drill. Super thankful to my uh, local NRCS that just allow us small farmers to affordably uh, lease equipment in, in order to to perform our work and not have to go into debt and and buy a bunch of equipment or have stuff laying around so that we don't need very often and this last shot here was on January 4th of 2020 uh, the wheat's coming up good and just super pumped to uh, get out there and get the wheat harvested and have my own straw this year so thanks again for uh, tuning in uh, like comment and subscribe. See ya.